All you hear from women, feminists, every day, glass ceiling, patriarchy, glass ceiling, patriarchy. Here's how I know it's nonsense. Caitlin Clark isn't going to the Olympics. What a missed opportunity. They missed out on millions and millions of dollars that they could have made. Jersey sales, TV sponsorships, all because of Caitlin Clark. And she's home. She has to stay home. And people are going to say, well, she's a rookie. She's a rookie. Camila Cardoza is playing for Brazil. She's playing. The Brazilians don't care about that. She's coming to play. Christian Leitner played. He didn't play meaningful minutes. They picked him. Because he was a two-time national champion and number one player in college basketball. He didn't have any NBA CV. He doesn't have an NBA CV. And he got to go. Because he's a name. It was a dream team. And they needed. They wanted to put one college player on the team. And they picked him. You bring the names. If she goes... If she's at Olympic Village, she's a top three star. Top three star, man or woman. International. I just can't believe that they're so short-sighted to not understand the amount of money they could have made if she if she was chosen. Disgrace, the, the jealousy in this league is just at an all-time high. She has to go just to just to be based on the symbol of women's basketball. Because women's basketball is big in Europe. They do well internationally. Not on TV. The Caitlin Clark story transcends basketball. It's bigger than anything that, that, that the men have going right now. No one cares Kevin Durant's there. No one cares Kawhi Leonard's there. LeBron James. No one cares. They've seen it before. It's nothing new. If she was on this team for the women, it's a brand, it's a whole new era of women's basketball. And the ratings they would have garnered. Again, jersey sales, TV sponsors, sponsorships, and ratings. Just a disgraceful, d- this disgraceful choice. Disgraceful choice. But one thing we no longer have to hear. We don't have to hear those terms anymore patriarchy and glass ceiling we don't have to hear it and we know it's nonsense but we don't have to hear it anymore because they had an opportunity to grow their own sport organically and they chose not to